Good morning. Today is Friday, November 3rd. It is a blue day. On Monday, 9th graders will be exchanging their Chromebooks. AS a reminder, on that day the Chromebook and case must be present in order to receive a new one. Due to busing issues at Centurich, the home WI varsity football playoff game this evening, November 3rd, has been changed to a 6.30 p.m. start time. The counseling office will be hosting a college fair today from 8 to 9.30 in the lower gymnasium. The college fair is for juniors, period 2, and seniors, period 3. 11th and 12th grade students will only be permitted during their assigned period. Attention 9th graders. 9th grade mathletes will be having their next competition meeting on Wednesday, November 8 at 2.15 p.m. in room 103. All practices and meets are open to all students in 9th grade. Mr. Michelle looks forward to meeting you soon. Attention students who are applying for National Math Honor Society this year, applications are due by Thursday, November 9th to Mrs. Nanda or Ms. Annunziata. Attention all varsity mathletes. Practice will be held Monday, November 6th in room 231 at 2.15 p.m. Please see Mrs. Yost or Mrs. Davis if you have any questions. Fall Colors Photo Contest. Share your best fall pictures with everyone in the high school. Pictures can be taken with your camera or cell phone and submitted to Mr. Weber by email or download. Recognition will be given for each grade level, including teachers and administrators. Submit your photos by November 9th. Attention West Islip students. Spectrum is sponsoring a fall writing contest. Writers may choose from one of three categories for submission, poetry, short story, or miscellaneous. For submissions like creative essays, scripts, or something surprising and original. The topic is, autumn, or anything fall-related. The deadline for submissions is by December 1st to Mr. Gershfeld or a member of Spectrum. There will be prizes for two category winners and one grand prize for the best overall submission. Let's get to work. There will be a brief meeting of the boys' swimming and diving team next Wednesday, November 8th at 2.30 in room 208. The meeting will be brief. We look forward to seeing our veteran athletes and meeting our new ones as well. Come support the girls' varsity gymnastics team at their individual county championship meet today in the upper gym at 4 p.m. There will be a meeting for all girls interested in running winter track to Thursday, November 9th immediately after school in room 110. Please see Ms. Studley if you cannot attend the meeting. Attention all wrestlers, there will be mandatory meeting for anyone planning on being part of the wrestling team this year Monday in room 186, right after school. Please make sure you are registered on final forms and bring any raffle money. The Mock Trial Club will have its first meeting on Wednesday, November 8, at 2.10 p.m. in room 208. If you are interested in law and want to experience a real trial, please come down for information. The meeting will be brief. If you have any questions, you can reach out to Mr. Jablonski. Attention cheerleaders. Anyone who is interested in trying out for the winter competitive season, please attend a brief informational meeting on Tuesday, 11-7, after school in room 286. Any questions, please see Ms. Barone. Del 15 de septiembre al 15 de octubre se celebra anualmente el mes nacional de la herencia hispana en los Estados Unidos para reconocer las contribuciones y la influencia de los hispanoamericanos a la historia, la cultura y los logros de los Estados Unidos. From September 15 to October 15, National Hispanic Heritage Month is annually celebrated in the United States to recognize the Confucians and influence of Hispanic Americans to the history, culture, and achievements of the United States. The time frame of this month is significant because many Central American countries celebrate their Independence Day within these days beginning on September 15 with Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, and Nicaragua. Durante el mes nacional de la herencia hispana, el gobierno de los Estados Unidos celebra las innumerables contribuciones de más de 60 millones de hispanoamericanos 
Algunos son políticos, activistas del movimiento de derechos civiles, inventores, científicos, autores, artistas o atletas. More than 60 million Hispanic Americans. Some are politicians, civil rights movement activists, inventors, scientists, others, artists, or athletes. Hispanic Americans are the largest minority group in the United States today. They constantly help make our country strong and prosperous. Hispanic Americans embody the best of our American values, including commitment to faith, family, and country. The Hispanic American community has left a significant mark on American government, culture, and economy. This year, theme is Latinos Driving Prosperity, Power, and Progress in America. This year, ENL students celebrate National Hispanic Month by recognizing many Hispanic Americans, discussing their achievements and contributions to not just Hispanic communities, but the United States at large. You can view the posters that we have created recognizing some of those famous Hispanic Americans by the main office. Gracias.